guys, my hands shaking. Look how much it's shaking just by the soundtrack of the car. Leviathan here today, we're gonna do a cruise with the McLaren 650S and of course the Ferrari F430, known as the Lamborghini Mustang. So let's go for a ride. For those of you that do not know, that is a Lamborghini Mustang. It might look like a Ferrari, it might sound like a Ferrari, but it is a Lamborghini Mustang. And it is one of my all time favorite cars. It just looks sexy, it sounds phenomenal, and it's just an incredible machine to drive. You guys have no idea. Yes, it's old, yes, it's not the fastest car, but oh my God, the driving experience in that car is just phenomenal. I can, all what I'm doing right now is I'm just driving behind it and it's making my heart race. It's really making my heart race. And today we're gonna do a little experiment. We're gonna see if the car changes the driving behavior. You're probably wondering what I'm talking about when my friend drives a Lamborghini Murcielago. Every tunnel he goes through, he drops down to first gear and just screams through the tunnel. Today, he's in a Ferrari F430, so I'm curious to know what his behavior will be like and if he's gonna do the same Lamborghini driver move. It is a common thing for car guys to do, dropping a gear going through a tunnel, but when he was in a Lamborghini Murcielago, it was instant, instant. Here it comes, let's see. I'm gonna drive quietly. Three, two, one. He's driving quietly, what happened? Another element that I love about the Ferrari F430 is its exterior is based on a lot of design elements from some classic Ferraris. The taillights, for example, is inspired by the Ferrari Enzo. Oh man, it's just phenomenal, phenomenal, phenomenal. I love that car. It has so much character, it has so much presence. I know a lot of people think, oh, it's just a 430, oh, there's a 458 now, there's a 488, blah, 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 but it's not necessarily, when you pick a car, you just don't buy it for performance alone unless you are competitive and you take it to a track. One of the biggest criteria for non-professional race car drivers is that driving experience. And with the Ferrari F430, you can't go wrong. It's a phenomenal driving experience. It's making me sad. It's really making me sad. So if I do get sentimental in this video, do not mock. It's the pitch of that sound which, oh. And he's really driving it hard and it's really making me feel sad. It's a very bittersweet day. As much as I love seeing it, it just brings back so many memories of that car. And it's still getting a lot of attention, more so than the McLaren. I guess because it's a red Ferrari. You guys are giving the Ferrari a thumbs up and checking it out. Blondie is checking it out as well, but I'm pretty sure that's a guy. Has anyone called your car a Mustang yet or no? Someone just said that he likes the Ferrari over the McLaren. That guy, oh, he's gonna count us down. <laughs> he's gonna give us the countdown. Cup in the air. <laughs> well, I'm in race mode right now, but I can't clear this fast. I, I'm not going to. This is gonna be the slowest start to a race ever. He must be thoroughly disappointed. I get a lot of hate from people saying, oh, it's such an old car, it's not the fastest. What's funny though is I still get the exact same hate in the McLaren 650S. People keep commenting, oh, the 675 LT is faster, or you should get the P1. There's always gonna be a faster car out there, but that's not really how you select the best car for you. It really comes down to the experience. And I love the experience in the Ferrari F430, and I love the experience in the McLaren 650S. Yeah, let's go! <laughs> Guys, my hands shaking. You can't freaking... <laughs> 
look at how much it's shaking just by the soundtrack of the car. Oh man! <laughs> that is exactly what I mean by driving experience. And that's what you get in these two cars. If it can make your hands shake, that's pretty much a good experience. Oh! <laughs> Picture, picture, picture. Oh my goodness, so many pictures. Everyone. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. He's such a Ferrari driver. It's really funny. In the Lamborghini, it'd be instant in a tunnel. Here, each time I see a pothole, it's like zzz, 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 zzz. pure, pure difference in driving style. It's not the driver, it's the car. I see a pothole. Three, two, one. <laughs> Avoid every single bump, man. Every single one is swerved. Every single one. I hope you enjoyed that ride along with the Ferrari F430 and the McLaren 650S. While it did not leave tears running down my cheeks, it definitely put a smile on my face and made my hands shake. Thanks for watching. Until next time.